I'm sorry, but this is one thing Mr. Tinker definitely cannot fix. But I know who can. Daisy, we've got a green thumb trouble call. Green thumb trouble? Where? Daisy, I didn't water my plant, and now she's not feeling so good. Ooh, she is dry. But you know what? Let's see what we can do. Sometimes I forget to do things like water my plants or clean my room. I just get so busy. I had the same problem, Anna. That's why I made these sticks, to remind myself of all the things I have to do. I put down things like feed my my or clean my bedroom, and when I do the chore, I move it from the to-do cup to the done cup. Yeah, but Mr. Tinker, I don't like to do chores. Neither did I, but Little Rose changed my mind about that. Who's Little Rose? Little Rose is the little girl that lives inside the rose. She gives the rose its flower power. Wow, do all flowers have flower power? They sure do. I'll bet the little girl inside your flower is having the same problems that little Rose had. What problem? It was just one week ago. Little Rose woke up all excited because the sun had told her and her two friends, little Lily and Iris, that they were going to blossom. Isn't it wonderful news, said Little Rose? Yes, said Little Lily, and we better prepare by shining our petals and cleaning our stems and picking up trash around our base. We only have seven days before blossom time, said Iris. But while the other two girls went back home to clean and shine, Rose stayed in the garden to play. And the next day, Little Rose came down to the garden to play, but her two friends were still inside. We were busy cleaning and shining, said Iris, but now we're ready to play. But Rose shook her head. I'll clean later, said Rose. Every day that passed, more and more dirt would gather around little Rose's flower. The petals were getting dingy. The weeds were poking into her window until a whole week passed, and it was blossom time. Oh, no, said little Rose. My flower is cluttered, and there's too much dirt inside for my flower to blossom. Little Rose tried quickly to clean her room, but she cleaned and cleaned until the day turned into night and the sun finally went down. Little Rose cried, I put off my chores and there's just too much to do. Little Iris and Lily came over and hugged Little Rose to make her feel better. Just remember, said Little Lily, you do a little chore every day to make the dirt go away. And when the chore is done, then it's time for fun. Yeah, said Little Iris. When your chores are done, you feel proud, and that's like blossoming a little every day. The three girls gave each other high fives, then dusted and shined until Little Rose was feeling as good as her flower looked. Little Rose beamed with pride until she felt full of flower power. And I like doing my chores because when I'm done, I feel proud of myself. It's like having a little bit of flower power every day. You got it. <laughs> chores, chores don't go away. You gotta do them every day. Get it done and have some fun. A little goes a long, long way and you'll have much more time to play. Get it done and have some fun. I'm proud of me. You gotta have responsibility. I'm so Bring over the tea and snacks, Anna? What's for snack today? 
graham crackers and grapes. All right. <laughs> and Anna, when you come back, I'll show you how to make a special craft flower pot to help you to remember to do your chores. I'm so excited. Flower power. <laughs> and kids, you can click on the window next to me and you can follow along as we make a flower power chore chart. Get ready, it's tinker time. Cause it's tinker, tinker time.